It's a new day. Thanks to the Evans Institute, talent will never be wasted again. Our revolutionary new procedure removes one person's talent and transplants it into someone else. We've helped change countless lives. Could yours be next? Could yours be next? Could yours be next? Come save me, I'm breaking down. So tomorrow, no excuses, I need it. Yeah. Hey, hey, wait up. <laughs> hey. It's me, Lucy. I gave you my demo. Yeah, right, 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 the demo, the um, uh, No Man Chronicles, right? Yes. Yes. Yes, oh, yeah. exactly. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> hell of a voice there, yeah. It got a lot of potential. Wow. I mean, you know, coming from you. <laughs> Don't mention it, all right? Stay positive and uh, you have your good one, all right? Okay. Hold up. <laughs> um, if you liked me, do you think that you would ever book me here or anywhere? I mean, not right now, all right? But you do me a favor, uh, work on your voice and your, and your craft and maybe down the road. <laughs> uh, wait. Um, Fast. What if I need to know right now, this very second, this very minute, okay. if I have what it takes to make it. What do you, what do you want me to say? Hmm? The truth. <laughs> Am I good enough? Sure, sure, y yes, you're good. That doesn't always mean it's enough. You know? I, I don't understand. Jesus. All right, look, <laughs> you want the truth? You, you want the truth? Yes. All right, well, fine. You want to know if I would ever book you? The answer is no, I would never book you. Not here, not, not anywhere. You want to know why? Because you got no buzz, you got no heat, no je ne sais quoi, no Instagram followers, no, no, no YouTube subscribers, and you're not even screwing anybody in this city that remotely matters. Like, I'm in the business of creating stars, you know? They shine so bright that they blind me and anybody that comes within 10 feet of their orbit. And honey, it ain't you. I'm sorry.
were so thrilled when the service told us that you were open to meeting us and hearing our offer. Mm -hmm. Can I get you something to eat or drink or both? <laughs> I can't believe you made this by hand. <laughs> These are amazing. Oh. Well, the Evans Institute found us this sweet little Asian man who could take a cup of noodles and some spices and turn it into a five-star cuisine. Oh, so you've used this service before? Oh, lots of times, yeah. <laughs> um, so what happened to the chef? Well, it warms my heart to say that he used the money to bring the rest of his family over here. In fact, I think his daughter's going to Berkeley. Wow. Mm -hmm. um, Brenda, I gotta be honest, I... I don't know if I could do this. Well, that's why the Institute makes us meet. Because the procedure is permanent. And they wanna make sure that both sides are comfortable with the arrangement. Hey, no pressure. Small confession, though. When we heard you sing, it blew me and my husband away. How come some fancy record producer hasn't scooped you up? I don't know. I always thought it was a matter of when, not if. Hmm. It sounds cheesy. Topher always used to tell me that. And Topher? Or is he <sighs> not around anymore? Well, since you are finished with your food, how about we go and talk somewhere more comfortable? Okay. Okay. So. So. Um, why singing? Why that talent? Well, my daughter Penelope is turning 16. And rather than get her an Audi like everybody else, I wanted to surprise her. So, um, instead of giving her a car, you're giving her my voice as a birthday gift? Well, the Audi would just sit in the driveway anyway. She Ubers everywhere. Huh. And she is obsessed with the pop stars. So she wants to be a singer? Oh, totally. She tries out for all the high school musicals, and they always put her in the background choir. Just once. I want her to know what it's like to be under the spotlight. <laughs> Take it from me, there's no greater high like it in the world. Perfect. So she'll be hooked on singing and not drugs. This just gets better and better. <laughs> yeah. Please, you have to say yes. <laughs> yeah, no, I mean, it's tempting, but it just feels like I'm giving up. No, you're not giving up, Lucy. You're taking advantage of a very rare and prosperous opportunity. What about the chef, the guy that sold you his talent? What if he was destined to open up the number one dumpling spot in LA? And his daughter still could have gone to Berkeley and he still could have done what he loved. And what if he was destined to be a fry cook? What would happen to his daughter then? All I'm saying is that what if we're allowing people to give up their talent and robbing the world from the next Picasso or Beethoven. Honey, history only has one Beethoven. Aren't you sick of the constant rejection? Singing your heart out for no one and nothing? Of course I am. And no, I... I don't sing for money. I don't sing for adoration. I sing because, well, why do you breathe? For my daughter and from one mother to soon to be mother, everything will change. It's like your whole world just cracks open and you're holding this tiny little life. And it's at that moment that you will promise yourself, this child will never grow cold or hungry or ever be in need. Yeah, I'm not sure that'll ever be me. Well, motherhood isn't for everyone. There's no shame in that. 
Have you thought about adoption or? No, I'm not good. You know what? Please don't go. Not until you hear my offer. Usually, this part is left up to the lawyers. But I think we can handle it ourselves. This is three times the asking rate. That's how much I value your voice. Lucy, are your dreams really more important than your child's future? After this, I won't be able to sing anymore. Please just lie still. Okay, Lucy, I'm gonna put you in an awake craniotomy state. We need you to sing during the procedure. You need me to sing? Mm -hmm. It helps us map the correct neutral pathways in the exact region in the temporal lobe we need to splice. Any song you want. Whenever you're ready. It's over when you've lost the fight. It's easy to surrender, it's easier to cry. When you think you're not enough, it's hard enough to try. When you feel like giving up, it's hard to say goodbye. Come save me, I'm breaking down. Come hold me, why'd you have to let me drown? I'm shaking. Whoa, 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 whoa. You gotta eat more than that. You little caboose. Come on, eat up. Up next is the latest release from Penelope. In a recent Rolling Stones article, the pop sensation said she owed her entire career to her mother, Brenda. Aw, isn't that sweet? Mommy, mommy, is this enough? Yes, honey. It's enough. <laughs>